All right, man. Will Smith apologized. I'm gonna play a little bit of it. Um, people said oh, it was too late, and Will Smith's career is gonna be over, and this, that, and the third, and 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 uh, it's too late for this apology. Well, guess what? Apologies take time. You know, that's what people don't understand. Apologies take time. That's what be killing me about people. It should take time. A lot of y'all, they forgave y'all family members for no good reason. <laughs> oh, oh, because they told you no when you asked to borrow $20. <laughs> you know? Well, let's go, Will. Why didn't you apologize to Chris in your acceptance speech? Um, I was fogged out by that point. It's, 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 it's all fuzzy. I've reached out to Chris um, and the, mes the message that came back is that uh, he's not ready to talk. And when he is, he will reach out. Um, so I will, I will say to you, um, Chris, I apologize to you. Uh, my behavior was unacceptable and I'm here whenever you're ready to talk. Um, I, I want to apologize to Chris's mother. I saw an interview that Chris's mother did and you know that was one of the things about that moment I just didn't realize and you know I wasn't thinking but how many people got hurt in that moment. So I want to uh, apologize to Chris's mother. I want to apologize to uh, Chris's family, uh, specifically Tony Rock. You know, we had a great relationship. You know, Tony Rock was my man. Um, and uh, this, this, is, this is probably irreparable. Um, I spent the last three months um, replaying and understanding the nuances and and the complexities of what happened in in that moment um and i'm not going to try to unpack all of that right now but i can say to all of you there is no part of me that thinks that was the right way to behave in that moment there's no part of me that thinks that's the optimal way to handle a feeling of disrespect or, or insults. After Jada rolled her eyes, did she tell you to do something? No. Um, it's like, you know, I'm, I made a choice on my own from my own experiences, from my history with Chris, Jada had nothing to do with it. Uh, I'm sorry, babe. Um, and say sorry to my, my kids and, and my family for the heat that I brought on all of us. Um, to all my fellow nominees, you know, this is a community. It's like I won because you, you voted for me. And it, it, it really breaks my heart to have stolen and, and tarnished, tarnished your moment. Um, I can still see Quest Love's eyes. You know, it, it happened on Quest Love's uh, award, and you know, it's like I'm 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 sorry. Really, is it sufficient? What would you say to the people who looked up to you? before the slap or people who expressed that you let them down. Um, so there's two things. One, um, disappointing people is my central trauma. Um, I hate when I let people down. Um, so it, it hurts. Uh, it hurts me psychologically and emotionally to know I didn't live up to uh, people's 
image and impression of me. And the work I'm trying to do is I am deeply remorseful and I'm trying to be remorseful without being ashamed of myself, right? I'm human and I made a mistake and I'm trying not to think of myself as a piece of shit. Um, so I would say to those people, I know it was confusing. I know it was shocking. Um, but I, I promise you, I am uh, deeply devoted and committed to putting light and love and joy into the world. And, you know, if you if you hang on, I promise we'll be able to be friends again. All right, man. Um, that's the whole thing. You know what, man? Um, we ain't let nobody down. All right. Um, <clears throat> most of y'all out here killing over fighting over chicken sandwiches, shooting people over, stepping on y'all Jordans. I mean, he protected his wife. And that's what you do. That's, you know, that's that's one of them vows. Maybe it ain't an actual vow you get married, but that's one of them vows. Y'all can say she was a tramp, a thought, whatever you want to do. He knew what he signed up when he got when he got married to her. He knew what he signed up for. Y'all can talk about they swingers and all that type of stuff. A lot of people are these days, right? And Chris Rock don't seem to be too angry about it. Going around joking about it was that Will Smith? That's the, this the best thing that ever happened to Chris Rock career by far. He ain't, he ain't got this much attention since the nineties, bro. You know what I'm saying? And I'm a Chris Rock fan, fan, fan. Top five, down to earth, head of state, go on and on. I'm a fan of his of his comedy too. So this is the best thing that happened to Chris Rock, right? And you know, when Jay Z said everybody praising the one that gets shot, I'm, I respect the shooter. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Everybody praising him because he 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 took a slap, and he you know he rolled with the punches, not literally, but he rolled with the slap, <laughs> not literally though. And everybody praising Chris Rock, Chris Rock for rolling with the slap, but you don't talk about nobody family. You don't talk about nobody mama. You don't talk about nobody wife. You don't talk about nobody kids. Now you can talk about Will Smith, and Will probably would have just laughed. <clears throat> so no, I I mean if I'm Will Smith, man, hold my hold hold my stuff. How about that? But he got to do this to get back in Hollywood, <clears throat> you know. But this is the best thing to happen to Chris Rock career. But you got a whole bunch of people out here judging people who who are ready to kill people at any given time, who who was fighting over toilet tissue, ready to kill people over. Last toilet tissue two years ago. Come on. Who got roll rage ready to put a gun on another brother over some Jordans, over some shoes? I don't really believe in what society say. Everybody got their own dirty laundry. A lot of y'all out here doing worse. You know, now Will Smith went up there and slapped the woman, then hey, <laughs> yeah, you got to go in the, you got to be exiled, homie. But Chris Rock, He's perfectly capable of defending himself. You know? And Kiss Rock took that slap, and that's the best thing that happened to his career. And he has no response. He has no response. People say, well, Will can't take a joke, and Will can't do this, that. A lot of y'all niggas can't even take a nigga staring at y'all. Y'all ready to fight. Y'all ready to shoot. <laughs> People be scared of killing me. And if Will would have slapped y'all, a lot of y'all wouldn't have done nothing either. Let's keep it real. If Will would have smacked most of y'all, a lot of y'all wouldn't have done nothing either. You see these videos. You see these people in the street, bro. They get slapped and they take off running. You know? Oh, I ain't trying to, oh, that was me, nigga. I did this, that, and the third, and... Chris Rock of this, for one, that was me. I know, <clears throat> not talking about how I'm talking about nobody's family. 
you know. And that's straight up and down. No. No, and that's straight up and down. So, but you ain't let nobody down, bro. Everybody want to act like nobody commits sins, and nobody makes makes mistakes. That's the that's the funniest thing that I heard, bro. That everybody on social media I swear to God they perfect, bro. And I know a lot of these people. I know some. Who ain't really living like they living, dog. A lot of these dudes selling drugs to kids. A lot of these dudes putting their hands on, on women. You know, a lot of these dudes, you know, they ain't living right, stealing from their mama, stealing from their fans, breaking into their they family, they family's house, their houses. A lot of people falling out with their family because they couldn't they couldn't hold, they wouldn't let them hold $20. You know. So no, I ain't got nothing to be ashamed of. Chris Rock, a grown ass man. It wasn't like he slapped a kid or a woman, or they couldn't defend themselves. Chris Rock is, you know, he can defend himself. He can call for celebrity boxing match with Will Smith, but you know he won't. We, I'm not ready to talk about it. Of course, he milking it. He milking it. That's exactly what he's doing. He milking all. It's the best thing to happen to him, dude. When he ready, he's going to do a whole tour on it, bro. His ticket sales went all the way up through the roof. And don't nobody got sympathy for no any other situations. Don't nobody got sympathy for the dude on the side of the street that used to serve the, serve the country. Walking on the street with mental illness. Ain't nobody trying to help him. Let's keep it a thigh wide. Ain't nobody up there trying to help him. You know, ain't nobody got sympathy for that dude who who lost his job, who's stressing to provide, bro. Ain't no ain't nobody got sympathy for that dude. Think about that for, for a minute. Nobody got sympathy for that dude. But all of a sudden they got sympathy for, for a black man who got slapped. Cause he got slapped by another black man. We always gotta be in the weakest positions. And Will had a week, had a week, had a week, you know, had a weak spot. He's fast. It all happens, bro. You, you know, all of it built up. Well, he shouldn't be with Jada. And, you know, Jada got him stairs and stuff. Man, dog, a lot of these women got y'all, got y'all doing crazy shit, bro. Falling out with your homeboys. Acting different. Not being able to take a joke. You know, going to work on Ed. So don't judge Chris. Don't judge Will Smith. And a lot of y'all been going through the same thing, bro. That be killing me, dude. These niggas on the internet, especially them red pill, blue pill niggas. Swear to God, they ain't made no mistakes. Swear to God, they got the right. They got the right uh, a recipe for how to treat women, and and they, you know what they remedy is, and their recipe is go date nine black women because they can't handle it. Because they don't know how to hand, handle the situation. They, don't, they quote unquote, I'm an alpha, I'm an alpha. Oh, Will Smith ain't no alpha. Will Smith weak. Well, we said the Will Smith face and see what happened. Let's air out your dirty line. You don't even mess with black women. So, I mean, right then and there, red flag. Strike two strikes off the rip. Will Smith is, is with a black woman, bro. He ain't swirling or nothing or none of that shit. Well, you know, he in an open relationship. We've been through that about Will and Jada. That's what Jada family preach on. A lot of y'all in the open relationship sharing y'all woman and don't even know it. So these niggas on the internet acting like they, they resume is squeaky clean and it ain't. We know it ain't. We know. You know? Because if you truly had the answers, you wouldn't, you know, you wouldn't be sitting there arguing every day on the internet. You'd be writing a book and shit like that. So I ain't, I mean, like I said before, man, I ain't, if I'm Will, I ain't tripping over that shit. He got to do this to get back in the good graces of Hollywood. <clears throat> That's fine. <clears throat> That's fine. That's totally fine. He protected Jada again. 
because Jada had a lot to do with this. And in a lot of your situations, your stress in your situations as a man <clears throat> come from a, come from a woman. You know, a, a lot of that is part of a healthy relationship, to be honest. Because you really want a woman that you know, roll over, jump how high, high. You know, like Prince uh Prince Akeem and uh and uh coming to America, the first one, because the second one was trash. I stopped watching after 10 minutes. Sorry, Eddie. So ask yourself, do you really want want a woman like that? No, it's gonna help the relationship is it's some give and take. Not her dominating you, but it's give and take. You know, I scream, women scream, well, protect black women, protect black women. And then when somebody do, then it's, you know, then it's a no-win situation, bro. It's a no-win situation. That's exactly what it is. So you always go, you do what you feel. Trust me, do what you feel. Do what you feel is right, but... That is what it is. Let me know what you girls and guys think. <clears throat> Thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. The subscribe button is the bell icon button. Hit all notifications. Increase your chance of notifications. We go live and drop video. If you want to support the channel, cash out dollar sign CJ Good 313. Memo CJ Good 313. PayPal in the description. If you want to support the channel, cash out dollar sign CJ Good 313. Memo CJ Good 313. PayPal in the description. You can find me on Apple Podcasts, Spotify. Amazon Music, Radio Public, and a couple more. Um, we're going to reach out, we're gonna reach out uh, Twitter and Instagram is the only way. My link tree is the first link in the description. Appreciate the love support. Um, you know, peace. Check out the Music Entertainment playlist. Don't forget, <clears throat> you can find uh, my other channel, my Detroit channel, Marty C Sports Talk, right here on YouTube, Marty C Sports Talk. Peace.